Hello, children. How wonderful to see you. Today, we are learning to solve subtraction word problems where you see subtraction in the real world. Are you ready? Let's begin. Question 1. Emma has nine flowers. She gives Laura two flowers. How many flowers does Emma have left? I give you some time to find the answer by yourself. Let's find the answer together. Emma has nine flowers. She gives Laura two flowers. We subtract two from nine to find the number of flowers Emma has left. So, nine minus two equals seven. We conclude Emma has seven flowers left. Question two. Seven birds are sitting on a branch. Five birds fly away. How many birds are left on the branch? I give you some time to find the answer by yourself. Let's find the answer together. Seven birds are sitting on the branch. Five birds fly away. We subtract five from seven to find the number of birds left on the branch. So, seven minus five equals two. We conclude two birds are left on the branch. So, you've solved some word problems. Notice these keywords have left, are left. They tell you to subtract. Often, you may see other keywords that also tell you to subtract, such as difference, remain, and away. Let's carry on. Question 3. There are 10 students in a classroom. Four of them are boys. How many girls are there? I give you some time to find the answer by yourself. Let's find the answer together. There are 10 students in the classroom. Four of them are boys. The rest should be girls. We can use a number bond to model this problem this way. So, to find the number of girls, this means to find this part of the number bond. We subtract the other part from the whole. 
Here, we subtract 4 from 10. We get 6. We conclude there are 6 girls in the classroom. Sometimes we can use a number board to model a word problem. If you have to find a part, just subtract the other part from the whole. Super! You have finished the lesson. I hope you enjoy it. If you have any question, don't hesitate to put it in the comment box. I'd be very happy to answer. Bye for now and see you soon.